Obviously, your journey is slightly different. So, would you say, even though you are influenced, like with your grandparents, your parents, and also, yeah, I have the most interesting friends who are also photographers. Mm -hmm. Like I'm talking about me, Emma. Yeah, you <laughs> and <laughs> you and. Mm -hmm. A couple of yeah. interesting, good photographers from Roots of Africa to Ilungu to Mohabi to Mutua Madeka, Peter Size 10, mm. mentalists. Uh, and let me not miss to say these two amazing food photographers in Nairobi. Yeah. Mama Olive, known as Tatiana Karanja. Oh, Tatiana is my good friend. And Jay Mwai. Ah, yeah, yeah. Let me tell you, mm -hmm. if I didn't meet Jay Mwai when I was trying to find my bearing, I would have never thought of taking on food photography as a full time. Mm. Mm -hmm. As a full, full time full-time job job mm -hmm. she's amazing at what she does what about her is special Jimoy Jimoy is such an amazing lady I knew as a friend mm -hmm. first yeah before the title photographer mm -hmm. I feel like that's important Knowing it is someone it is as okay. a human being first mm -hmm. because before adding the the titles the doctors the yeah. photographers yeah and when i saw her work at first i was like mm -hmm. damn she's doing something that's oh I, she she has amazing amazing food photography i was like she's doing something that i've always wanted to do mm. i hope she won't feel like i'm trying to Oh, yeah. Compete with her. Ah, yeah. Because that's one of the hardships, like in yeah. the industry. If you try and ask somebody, they might feel like, "Hey, now you you're going to you, you want to you want to take over my job." Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the market is so, so big, big, so to big, accommodate all of us. All of us. Everybody gets to eat. There's so yeah. much money for us to make out here. And you know. As much as I'd want to say Mutua Madeka. Mutua is a legend. Just start with that. Yeah. Made me focus. Mm -hmm. But also JMY and Tatiana Karanja. I, I, I give props to them. Tatiana, you hear that? I give... Tatiana, JMY. Oh my God. Big shout out. Big shout out to them. And... They also challenged me because mm -hmm. I was like, why am I not doing this? Yeah. Why is it that the mm. only females do yeah. it? No, yeah. I was like, okay, now I want to be the man who does this. Mm. Oh, wait, is there any other guy who's doing food photography? Yeah, there, there are a couple of there guys. There are a couple now, yeah. eh? Oh, okay, so. But, okay, but of it's course, I can say, like. Of, actually, I don't want to say something that <laughs> people will come after me or like. First of all, I, I, I don't like going back and forth with guys online. So yeah. It's, it's like, I'm just that guy who is Oh, you have always, to be careful not to step into people's Yeah, opinion. I'm just, I'm that guy who's always, hey, 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 hey. Oh, on, yeah. yeah. On tweets and <laughs> comments. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. But, you know, what, what I've come to realize is, like, um, the... The problem, the setback that we're having like as men right now in Nairobi is like just in general not sharing information. You see, that's like a very big hurdle that we need to, to like just, I think, overcome or jump across because it's just people are not ready to share their knowledge, their skills and just inspire or Can influence I other people. That? Yeah, yeah, counter it, please. Men do share. Mm-hmm information but and teach and educate they do yes, I do 
who me nobody taught me shit mm-hmm. when I was trying to nini I had to go to YouTube all the people that I was looking up to all these people who do like nice music videos mm-hmm. nice ninis I kept on asking them can I come on your set try this and that now even where I was working I begged them to like oh can I come and just see how you guys shoot in commercials it's it's those guys because photographers do share knowledge mm. 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 I've learned as much as I learned so much on YouTube mm-hmm. I learned so much from my fellow photographers okay well, that's interesting they share knowledge i think it's sometimes how you reach out to someone ah come on my people skills are on point sunny what do you mean i talk to everyone but does that cut across to everyone who not everyone, everyone. not everyone knows how to reach out and okay for them. yeah true but seriously me hmm. okay Okay. If you just in even case, go like back in history like just look at my like how I talk to people. In your case it's not you. I think it's the the people. Yeah, it's not just me, it's yeah. many other people who've tried to reach out to them. They never got like you know. till that. Mm-hmm. I see how photographers engage. Yeah, oh yeah, you have these meetups and everything and so yeah. They're no longer that many as before, but mm. they do share knowledge. They, they give still, tips. They still they do. they recommend guys like ah, you know, mm. shooting in Nairobi is is a problem, but there's also there's always this place you can go and mm. shoot without the police being. Oh yeah, leg. plus you even have an association. It's yeah. very different for yeah. photographers. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. It makes sense because even for me, reaching out to Tito is a photographer, my videographer, yeah. and he was ready to. There is no video director is going to come to my podcast. They won't. Because right. they're all assholes. All assholes. <laughs> they won't. From people who do commercials and in, like I know so many people art directors who are uh, like just directing me. We are friends. We are friends, but they can never like just give you like a minute to share and I came to realize that you can always make time. If somebody wants to make like just Five, five minutes of their yes, time to yes, yes. share this and that they can do that but yeah. just most of them like which is also not bad so that leaves us for youtube and everything else which we can still learn because like, yes. you can't force people to and that's why like even for my podcast i try and just extract information you see i'm o- i'm asking you about this and this so that somebody if somebody's watching they can be like hey okay sir kumbe if i'm doing food photography I can do A, B, C, and D. And also, just avoid like the people you surround yourself with. Yeah, matter. Yeah. The days I post something and I'm like, ah, oh, this image. This. My friend said messages me and it's like, yeah, the color up or you edit up or like uh, you can, you mm. can, like I've seen, I've seen you better work than or this. you can do better than you this. You can do better than this. Mm. Or maybe your image composition wasn't well or this. S- they give yeah, good criticism. Mm. Mm. Okay, interesting. Interesting. That I never get from videographers. Now let's move from Plus, that. <laughs> yeah. Plus yeah. food is always a good conversation starter.